I love Christmas movies. We are going up. Number two. Going to two. Hotel lobby. Baby. It's the lobby of the hotel. That's it. Hotel, hotel, holiday in. Second floor. <laughs> and you take your friends. Uncultured swines. Welcome everyone, Team Seven, on another adventure. And today we're at the Gaylord Palms for what's it called? I love Christmas movies. I just finished reading the sign still. And also to a search show, Cirque Unwrapped. What's it called? I think Cirque Dreams Unwrapped. You already know. I don't know anything. I'm just along for the ride. So join us. There's like a little map here. I don't know how much this costs. My wife did it. This is a, it's like Gaylord Palms. The atrium. Where's she going? I thought the stage was over there. The stage is real where the tree is. Where's she going? So yeah, see, you actually have balconies on the inside. Pretty cool concept. The Grinch. We just walked in a complete circle. <laughs> this is a cool resort. We thought about staying here a few times. We're in! <laughs> Haven't done that in a while. I don't know if it was on accident or on purpose, but they got nobody, nobody sitting in front of us. Wait, look, you can't see my legs. Camouflage. They camouflaged. Okay, so here we are, patiently waiting for the show to start. Nine more minutes. Nine more minutes. Nine more minutes. It's been a while since we've all been here like this, right? Yeah. It's been a while. It is moments till showtime, so politely we ask for the safety of artists, no cameras, no flash, and especially no cell phones that always distract. Now, show off your style and put on your mask, since caring for others is really quite apt, as we celebrate Christmas with Sir Dreams Unwrapped. Kayla's standing out of the way reading her manga. Look at her. What are you reading? Dragon Ball Super. Dragon Ball? Dragon Ball Super. Dragon Ball Super? Yeah. Okay. The new chapter came out on Sunday. Never okay. It yet. <laughs> That's all you do, man. <laughs> uh, you don't know if you call me out like that. I'm just saying. Every time I look at you, you're reading. You're reading something. So, I just want to perform was right there. Yeah, she was the sale. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I thought that was pretty cool. Yeah. Cool part was the jump rope. Yeah, that was the really cool. The jump rope, yeah. I don't think I've ever seen Of course, you didn't get to see that, but I've never seen anybody jump rope like that before, right? Especially three people at the same time, and e each holding a, each holding one handle from somebody else's jump rope. It's hard to explain, but when you see it, it, it was crazy. I wish I could record it, but as, as you can see, there's no recording. You like it? Yeah, that was cool. It was different than other years, right? I don't know. Like I know last time we saw it was like three years ago. Really? And I know, yeah, I remember last time we saw it, there was a seesaw performer. Oh like yeah, a that's dad, right. And he had like two daughters or something. Yeah, and yeah. They would jump on the seesaw and they go and do like yeah. these spins. I can't. Yeah, I can't even remember. Yeah, it was different though. Yeah, it was. Like the jump ropes. Yeah. <laughs> that was the that was the that was the kicker, right? Yeah. Like it was all pretty cool. The jump ropes though. Yeah. All right, off we go. They got cocktails here too. I'm gonna go check out see what kind of cocktails they have. 
Okay, so you wind up getting the Corazon Star and uh, it's what? Tequila? Tequila with white cranberry juice, which is pretty good. It's very good. It's a good mix. I wish it was bigger. I wish it was bigger too, and of course if I made it it would be would be some kind of some kind of overproof or you know what this will taste good with? Ray and nephews overproof. Because I you know I like funky Jamaican rum. So I say we go get it. Yeah, probably. Yeah, yeah. It's funny too because I want to make coquito, but I want to make it my way, which is probably going to be sacrilege. Being I'm Puerto Rican, and I won't use any kind of donku or Bacardi or any of that stuff. So, of course, uh, yeah, I'm going to use something a whole lot different. Who knows? Maybe I should start a drinking channel. Yeah, we drink enough. We drink enough, but also too, we know how to mix. We know how to mix drinks. Not a bartender, never. Like yeah, never tried to be a bartender, right? But we still know how to mix drinks. And also, too, we have a good. I kind of have a knack for tasting ingredients and knowing how it would work in a drink. So, yeah, maybe who knows? Who knows? If this infinite possibility. We're definitely gonna have to do something, right? Definitely changes coming to the channel. So, we'll see next year. We'll wait till next year. Definitely something, something different coming to the channel. Then once I get this motorcycle, definitely, definitely gonna be a lot of motorcycle videos. <laughs> You're gonna see a lot of me going really fast on a motorcycle. La, 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 la. <laughs> she didn't hear that. <laughs> what? No, I said nothing. Oh, I said nothing. Absolutely nothing at all. So just waiting for the girls. What? And it's coffee bean place. Mm -hmm. it's, it's actually gonna make Starbucks. Though. Yeah, yeah. I think Alexa's trying to get a. Uh, Vanilla bean frappuccino. Oh, that's what she's trying to get? Yeah, these kids grew up on Starbucks, right? I'm like, Starbucks and Panera. What bougie kids? <laughs> My goodness. Gotta anyway, get the use. Gotta get the use. So we're headed to uh, the uh, Guy Love Christmas. How much is that? I don't know. We can buy a package, which is different. I think the I think maybe $25 or $26. How many people? Per person? Per person. Oh, okay. So, to give you perspective, the show and the movies, everything costs $206. For all four of us? For all four of us. Oh, okay. So, roughly $50 each. Okay. And you heard, you heard it from both? But there's packages that you can do other things that just Get yeah, like a snow tubing and stuff. Tubing. Yeah. yeah. Make snow balls. Oh, they got snow too here? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. But they didn't want to do any of that, which I'm kind of sad about, and I don't want to do it by myself, so. I'm going to get out of here. You should have just done it. <laughs> okay, so it's, yeah. you, you don't want to do it either, so. No, I don't, no, I don't want to do it. I, don't want, I grew up in the snow. I hate I, snow. I don't want to do snow, snow. I had enough of snow. I live in Florida. Well, I don't want to what fun is it to throw snowballs at yourself? Hey, you know I mean, what it'd be like to be an only child. <laughs> Not everybody has the benefit of having siblings, right? Spoiled. Spoiled. Who? <laughs> I have siblings. I'm just saying. That's what I'm saying. You have siblings, so you want to do a thing with other people. Hey, anyway, let's head to this I Love Christmas thing. She is. She's she gonna get a huge one. We yeah, she's gonna get a huge one. Watch, it's gonna be. We'll see. I want to have to drink that after drinking this, and then my stomach is gonna be bubbly, bubbly, bubbly. It'll be like Sean Paul, bubbly, bubbly. Just oh, thinking. Great mind stick, I like. Thank you. Ooh. Trees of Christmas. It's a reindeer. It's a, looks like a moose. 
Did I say that loud? I think I said that loud. Hey everyone, you're almost ready to step into some of your favorite Christmas movies. Before you head to set, here are a few helpful reminders. He's scanning your tickets up there. Special someone. himself to do a little decoration. Oh, 
Oh, it's a light bright. You sit on a throne of lies. What a great quote, right? I always love it. All right, guys, now that's the end of Elf. We're heading to our next movie. There's hand sanitizer provided. You're welcome. Let's go on down. That's why I let Kayla touch it. I got a bad feeling about this. No. You don't have to like. All right, guys. So this is. The snow miser. Right next to, right in front of City Hall. You don't remember that to wrap?
That's a, yeah, that's a word. That's a word. FedEx doesn't understand. Fragili. Hey, Mr. Parker. I wish I had an old radio like that, right? No, I don't. I'm just lying. I like the aesthetic of it, but I don't want it. Oh, wow. Look at those dishes in the sink. Oh, she thought that was so. We got this in that jar at home. I'm sorry. I was daydreaming over there. Yeah. All right, guys. Wasn't that fun? Yeah. All right, guys. Now we're gonna go to the Polar Express. Yay! Now we have to say our magic words before we go. You ready? Yeah. One, two, three. That's, That's a wrap. Right. Good job, guys. Now let's head to the Polar Express. You guys are coming first, and then you guys are following. Let's go.
Christmas Day, 12:25. Hello. Choo choo. I used to have a flashlight like that too, that looked just like this. Ooh, I'd make a nice bookshelf. Go on a snow bar. Guys, we're gonna hop off the moving train. I know this is something we don't usually do in real life. We're gonna do this in the movies. You ready? Yeah. Let's hop. 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 I said tuck and roll. Tuck and roll. Hop. Tuck and roll. Made it. <laughs> All right, guys, get close to the elf. All right, guys, now look. It's a bell, right? Yes. I need your help. This bell has not been working at all. Now, for the further ado, I need you to say the magic word. The magic word is, I believe in Santa Claus. Say it. I believe in Santa Claus. You did it, guys. You did it. Hi, times. One of the kids, didn't he? The narrator. Oh, yeah. Yep. All right, guys. Now, without further ado, we're going to be going for our next movie. You ready? One, two, three. That's a wrap. This is so good, guys. Don't make me cry. <laughs> Now, without further ado, we are going in there. Now, you will have Moose 
eggnog that had spiced eggnog. And the RV. Everything was owned by who? The crazy cousin Eddie. You guys are coming first and you guys are following. Let's go. In 1989, this movie was released and it earned almost $71 million off of this movie. That's a lot. Now we're going to go see the house first. Are you ready? Yeah. He picked out a tree from the forest just for you. How thoughtful. Aww. Squirrel in there. Right over here. Alright, guys, the tree oh. Wow. Did, did you just see that? Yes. What are we missing? The star. That's the small, yeah, the star, but the squirrel. The squirrel. Really now, the squirrel's getting away from something, right? The cat. Fluffy. Fluffy is like being wired. I don't know why. You need to bring it up. Fluffy, where are you? Fluffy? Fluffy? Oh my god. <laughs> Grace.
terrifying. Oh, look at that! They're bringing ice back. That was cute. That was cute. That was definitely cute. Danielle was very energetic. She was. She was. She was great. The grass is good. I wonder if that's fake or real. That's fake. You think? Yeah, absolutely. That's enough. Hello, sure. stage. We got fireplace out there. Oh, they got two fireplaces. Oh, yeah, right here. And nobody's interested. Unless it's a little late in the season. Yeah. <laughs> I, mean, I don't know how long this is going to be here, yeah, right? Okay, so that's going to wrap it up for today's episode. And today's adventure, so as always. Are you in the Christmas spirit now? Am I? I said are you? Well humbug. <laughs> I'm, I'm in the after Christmas spirit. And on that bombshell, until the next adventure. Deuces.